Right then, so this evening I thought I'd uh, try the uh, landscape photography on YouTube challenge this month, which is bridges. So uh, I travelled quite far this evening. Uh, yeah, definitely. Um, I left my house at about quarter past seven. It's now twenty past seven. Uh, so yeah, pretty tired after that, you know journey so anyway yeah I've just come down uh, to do a little short vlog here for the uh, September YouTube challenge which is stone bridges so uh, I'm gonna spend a bit of time here this evening try and get the shot for that hopefully uh, hoping for some color in the sky I know I'm asking a lot but we'll see but yeah we'll just have a look around here and uh, see what we can get So the idea behind me now, I've got two boats in the foreground. I've got the jetty just going out on, on an angle on the side and the bridge just behind it. So what I'm hoping for is just a bit of color in the sky in about an hour's time, if I'm lucky. Uh, so that's one composition. I'll also just walk around here and just look to see if I can find anything else of any interest. Now, there's hardly no wind whatsoever. I'm by a river, I'm surrounded by trees, so I bet you anything, them bloody midges are going to be popping out in the next hour um, and ruin things. Right, so what I've done is a pan. Twat. So, what I've done on this shot is a panoramic uh, of about four to five stitch. Uh, images. Uh, on the left I've got one of the boats then you've got the jetty leading out and then you've got the boat on the right here and right to the right of the frame you'll have this tree on the side and the bridge which I'm having a bit of light on it now so that's why I've sort of bracketed it now. I'll probably take one shot uh, on the 16 just a jetty on that boat so I've got some light on the on the bridge so later Actually, no, I forget that. Doesn't make sense. I've also uh, flown the drone. I've taken a 5 HDR shot from up there, looking down. Uh, yeah, so I think that should be quite interesting. So, yeah, just doodling around and waiting for the light. Uh, well, for some colour in the clouds, hopefully. So we shall see. So the shot over here has caught my eye. Um, there's a lot of green wreaths, I think you call them, in the distance there. Uh, the sun's shining on them, which has caught my eye. Uh, you've got some rocks on the foreground of the lake. So what I've done is just set up a little composition here of the three little trees, the light shining on the wreaths, and the rocks that are on the, uh, the little river here that leads into the lake. So just something that caught my eye when the light was on it. So I've 
done this one, I've bracketed this one, ISO 100. Yeah, I've bracketed this one, ISO 100, F9, uh, 1 40th of a second, and uh, done it one each end on this one. So I've tried a variety of different shots. I've uh, stood over there, sort of looked um, to the boats from the side. I've also sort of done it on an angle, just trying different angles really to see which one works the best. So yeah, uh, I think I'm going to go for a portrait next. I've seen the uh, just the boat here with the chain. Uh, so I'll focus with that bit of light on the bridge. Might make a nice portrait shot. Right, uh, I've just moved to the other side of the uh, bridge uh, and I've come across another composition, nothing to do with the bridge uh, but some nice light on the side of the tree here and some nice stones leading out into the lake and what I like about it, it just, I've just done a panel right across and you can see Snowden uh, at the end of the frame, it's a lovely shot uh, I just like the light on the tree, it just looks brilliant. Um, so I bracket this uh, about four stitches, looks great. I just hope it turns out great, It'd be a nice uh, sort of image. Uh, right then, um, I've come out here now just so I can get a shot of the bridge from the other side uh, looking at the house. Um, yeah, not going to get much light from this side, but. That's another perspective of the bridge anyway. So I'll take a shot of the bridge, then uh, the last shot I put, put up on this will be for the group uh, Landscape Photography on YouTube UK, which will be for the September challenge of a bridge, of whichever image I choose for that. So right then I'm just going to doodle around this point. And I might go back to the other side after, depending on what's going to happen with the clouds. It's quite possible it'll get some colour, so we shall see.
some nice cloud coming in right under Snowden now. It looks really good. Uh, got some nice colour on it, like golden. Um, what I've decided is to do a long exposure on this. Um, I've got a six and a six ND grad and a point nine soft grad. Uh, ISO 100 F9 and we'll try this at. 10 seconds of the one. Yeah, so I'm glad I came out tonight. I uh, think I got some nice shots, uh, even some aerial shots with the drone, uh, which I'm happy about. Uh, yeah, so I'm trying to think, did I get a shot from this side in the end? I think I did anyway, yeah. Uh, and I got some nice long exposures here of Snowden and smoothed the lake out here. So yeah, uh, so I think that's it. Little vlog from uh, down the road. Uh, with the intention of doing the vlog for landscape photography on YouTube UK with the, the theme of the bridge. So, and this is the image that I'll uh, put up for that. So, uh, I hope you've enjoyed this little vlog and until next time, thanks for watching and please do subscribe if you want to see more videos. So until next time, bye.